watch the northern lights flash Took a photograph on a Paris street Have you ever climbed a tall tree? Asked someone for mercy Gave something away that wasn't free I don't wanna get a vision of you stuck in my head Because I know that you were meant to be wilder Another night of television while you're lying in bed It's slowly gonna be the death of you Everybody, look what arrived this morning. <laughs> so these are the two pieces of work surface and they came quite early this morning and we were still asleep so we had to jump out of bed and come to the convent to meet the delivery guy. Um, and actually we didn't arrive in time so Simon was here already so he took the delivery and we had to drag them up the stairs this morning. Well, I didn't. I supervised. <laughs> yeah, so we're going to get them unpacked and um, see how they go on. There should be in that package somewhere some sort of things that we need to fix it all together. I think the first one goes here and the second one here. Yeah, that's how it. How are they designed it? No, they wanted to do it mm -hmm. when I went there. They wanted because. They didn't want to do so measure, like made to mm. measure. They were going to do one across there. Mm. So you'd have one bit there, so then they'd have a line across. And then they were going to do a little bit here, <laughs> a little bit there, mm. a one across the end there, another piece. And because that, it's got like squares, isn't it? Like squares of wood, the design. It looked really bizarre and I was like, no, no, no. <laughs> How you, you know, they didn't cut it like three pieces? Well, like because they don't do it. The problem is they don't make it mm -hmm. um, like that. It has to be made, the back of it has to be longer, not the side of it. I don't know. <laughs> but anyway, that was the problem there, that gap. Okay, okay. Yeah, so let's get it unpacked then and uh, get it lifted on. So, there's the work surface. It's not put in the proper place at the moment. It's just been, we just put, sort of plumped it on there a bit. But they've cut out the size for the hob, so that's good. All we've got to do is cut through that last little gap to put our hob. 
and then we need to obviously it's got a join so we need to get um something that underneath we tighten it and it gets really tight and silicone in there and then that will be done and then screw it all in underneath but i'm well chuffed with that it looks really good let's have a look from this end it really finishes off the kitchen and then obviously we've got the um plinths for underneath they need to be cut to the right size and they can go on but we're going to do that last because we want to clean the floor underneath and voila